The northeastern United States is a geographical region of the United States bordered to the north by Canada, to the east by the Atlantic Ocean, to the south by the southern United States, and to the west by the Midwestern United States. The Northeast is one of the four regions defined by the United States Census Bureau for the collection and analysis of statistics. The Census Bureau defined region has a total area of 181,324 square miles with 162,257 square miles of that being land mass. Although it lacks a unified cultural identity, the northeastern region is the nation's most economically developed, densely populated, and culturally diverse region. Of the nation's four census regions, the Northeast has the second largest percentage of residents living in an urban setting, with 85%, and is home to the nation's largest metropolitan area. The Northeast is home to most of the Northeast megalopolis, the most economically significant and second most populated of 11 mega regions within the United States, accounting for 20% of US GDP. Geographically there is some debate as to where the northeastern United States begins and ends. The vast area from central Virginia to northern Maine, and from western Pennsylvania to the Atlantic Ocean, have all been loosely grouped into the northeast at one time or another. Much of the debate has been what the cultural, economic and urban aspects of the northeast are, and where they begin or end as one reaches the borders of the region. Using the Census Bureau's definition of the Northeast, the region includes nine states. They are many, New York, New Jersey, Vermont, Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Connecticut, New Hampshire, and Pennsylvania. The region is often subdivided into New England and the Mid-Atlantic states. This definition has been essentially unchanged since 1880 and is widely used as a standard for data. Tabulation. However, the Census Bureau has acknowledged the obvious limitations of this definition and the potential merits of a proposal created after the 1950 census that would include changing regional boundaries to include Delaware, Maryland, and the District of Columbia with the mid-Atlantic states, but ultimately decided that the new system did not win enough overall acceptance among data users to warrant adoption as an official new set of general-purpose state groupings. The previous development of many series of statistics, arranged and issued over long periods of time on the basis of the existing state groupings, favored the retention of the summary units of the current regions and divisions. The Census Bureau confirmed in 1994 that it would continue to review the components of the regions and divisions to ensure that they continue to represent the most useful combinations of states and state equivalents. Many organizations and reference works follow the Census Bureau's definition for the region. In the history of the United States, the Mason-Dixon line between Pennsylvania and Maryland traditionally divided the regions. But in modern times, various entities define the northeastern United States in somewhat different ways. The Association of American Geographers divides the northeast into two divisions, New England, which is the same as the Census Bureau and it has the same middle states, but adds Delaware. Similarly, the Geological Society of America defines the Northeast as these same states but with the addition of Maryland and the District of Columbia. The narrowest definitions include only the states of New England. Other more restrictive definitions include New England and New York as part of the Northeast United States, but exclude Pennsylvania and New Jersey. States beyond the Census Bureau definition are included in Northeast region by various other entities. Anthropologists recognize the Northeastern Woodlands as one of the cultural regions that existed in the Western Hemisphere at the time of European colonists in the 15th and later centuries. Most did not settle in North America until the 17th century. The cultural area, known as the Northeastern Woodlands, in addition to covering the entire Northeast U.S., also covered much of what is now Canada and others regions of what is now the eastern United States. Among the many tribes that inhabited this area were those that made up the Iroquois nations and the numerous Algonquin peoples. In the United States of the 21st century, 
18 federally recognized tribes reside in the northeast for the most part. The people of the northeastern woodlands, on whose lands European fishermen began camping to dry their codfish in the early 1600s, lived in villages, especially after being influenced by the agricultural traditions of the Ohio and Mississippi Valley. Societies, all of the states making up the northeastern region were among the original 13 colonies. Though many, Vermont, and Delaware were part of other colonies before the United States became independent in the American Revolution. The T.